Welcome to part three of this 56 GMC truck uh, build. In this episode, we're going to mock up the motor and transmission for the first time. We're gonna do some extra tube work and bracing around the rear section of the chassis for extra strength and also to mount the fuel tank. Then we're going to get on to the, start doing the wheel tubs and the tray modifications and the floor and the tray and those kind of things. So, hope you enjoy. the tube work for the fuel tank, uh, got the chassis Watsling brackets all tacked in position. Now on to making the Watsling bars, we've got to tweak them a little bit uh, from how we normally make them to fit obviously this style with the coilovers being on the inside of the frame. <laughs> that was really good. I'll do me, you do you. We're building this chassis for performance, uh, handling, making sure everything is as strong as possible, overkilling it if we can. It's definitely going to help in the long run uh, and pretty well stiffen it up as much as possible. Done. No rubber there. No evidence. What, what evidence? It wasn't me. Straight as a bent arrow. <laughs> Basically just cutting out the sheet metal to do the infill panels on the side. Trace it uh, going to the sandblaster now because we started on the wheel tub and the floor work and stuff like that, so it's gone off to be all cleaned up before it comes back and we carry on with that. As you can see, we've done some more tube work here at the back to carry the fuel tank and strengthen the rear of the chassis. Uh, the next thing is we'll get the diff back in it, we'll get the tail shaft done, and we've got a roll case to go on to and all sorts of other stuff. So hopefully enjoyed that last part and we'll see you next time. 